So, I just want to say before, <laughs> before this video starts, um, here's a trigger warning. I look very busted. <laughs> I look very busted throughout this video, throughout this vlog. So I just I just wanted to say that um, I'm sorry for looking ugly. Viewer discre discretion description Hey Siri Shut your bubblegum dumb dumb looking ass the fuck up. You know, you know what I'm trying to say, but um I'm sorry. <laughs> so don't don't get on me please please don't get on me so not much to say now so I guess get on with the video <laughs> Everybody, we're in Levi's right now, and it's buy one get one, fifty percent off, all jeans. Per. We are in Nike right now, and they have a lot of sports bras and shit. That is cute. I'm so Nike right now. So I'm gonna try on these pants. I have a few pants here and I'm gonna show them. Okay, cool. The black ones look bad, but these are so these are so cute. Woo! Oh, look at that. Yeah boy. Ignore my boldly cut shirt, but I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna get these. Can this focus? Okay. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go with these. We're in a bra store. Why you wear small? Here's a dog. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'm not trying to buy me a thumb up in here. What? Yo, what is this store? Hey guys, so my mom... Let me make sure this is focused. Okay, so my mom went to go to the bathroom and um, McDonald's. And I don't feel like taking off my mask because I feel kind of ugly. But, um, we went to Levi's and we, see, oh, fuck, went to Levi's. With chicken, the chicken, um. Yes, yeah, let me get done. Alright. And can I get, um. I got. I got this. It's um some lemon fees, I don't know. And I got a quesadilla. My mom got a bunch of stuff because I don't know. No, that's <laughs> yeah. yeah. I used to sleep on Taco Bell, like I used to thought it was, I used to think it was so bad, but it, it actually is really good. And I'm really addicted to it. She munching. He fucking that shit up. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, look at Anna Grande. I love her. 
I'm semi, I stay automatic. Money add then multiply, I call it mathematics. Um, we went to CVS and yeah, and we shopping on a budget. Well, my mom's not shopping on a budget, but I'm shopping on a budget because she loves to spend money. And I don't like spending money. I like to um, spend carefully, unlike my mom. So, yeah. So, what do we need? We need... Okay, I don't want to look for the... I want to get... I want to get... Mascara. I'm gonna get this one. I really like this one. This one's really good. And oh, my phone is gonna fall on my ass. And I wanna get one of these. Um, I wanna get one of these. False lash effect, waterproof, sculpted. Okay, so I think I'm gonna get this waterproof one. Yeah, cool. Four ninety nine each, and uh, I have a list, but I kind of don't want to look at it. Um, all right. So liquid liner. I think we're done here. We got two mascaras and eyebrow pencil. Do they have my shade? And they don't have my. Oh wait. Okay, they do. It's right here. I think this is it, Mom. This is all I need. And you. And I think that's it. I already finished my mom's smelling stuff. Yay! Maybe it's both. Maybe it's unisex. I tell y'all, y'all cannot bring me to Ross because I just start picking out shit. Like, bro, they have the cutest purses here. I can't breathe. But anyways, we're going. I'm going to the pants aisle. This is plus. Um, I'm looking for the pants for girls. Beer I have a bunch of stuff in my pants. I'm not feeling it all. Um, people are still ready. <laughs> There's a lot of people here. And I don't know what my mom is doing all this. So my strategy is this. My strategy is that I grab a bunch of clothes that I like. Other stuff is always and then Oh sorry. It's okay. So I grab a bunch of clothes that I like and I go through it at the end and I pick out anything that I don't really like. So I just pick out anything that I like and then I just go through it in the end. So that's the strategy we're going for. This is part one of a part two series. Um, this is only back to school shopping part one. Yeah, and I don't know when that will be out, so don't don't be on my ass, okay? Okay, great. So we made it to this part of the video. That means going to the hall part. Yeah. Woo. I look like someone's mom. Look how pretty it is. Oh my god, don't look at my pants. Anyways. Um, can we appreciate this top? And we got the pearls. Not real, obviously. I'm poor. What the fuck you laughing at? Broke people should never laugh! Anyways, video haul, haul time, haul time. Let's start with makeup because that's the smallest stuff that I got. Great. So let's start with yeah, we're gonna start with makeup. I went to CVS and I went to Ulta to get makeup. Um, 
let me organize it really quick because I really don't know my shade and stuff except the normal foundation that I get. That's the only like shade I know that I'm in. Like the stick foundation that I always use. I normally use stick foundation. So I got the Fit Me. Oops. Okay, someone's texting me. I got the Fit Me foundation in the 310 Sun Beige. Had this in sixth grade, literally, but did not match my skin. It was not it was not good. Okay, but I didn't pick it out. That's listen. Some girl in in Target picked it out for me, and it was way too dark. I don't know if she was racist or something, but it was it was way too dark. That's why I go with my mom, and my mom helps me pick. And yeah, I I think she was racist. Cause it was really dark. I looked like I was doing blackface. Like it was so dark. Next thing that I got is a Fit Me concealer because I don't have liquid concealer. I have stick concealer, 25 medium. Cool. So and then I got pressed powder, cause Fit Me pressed powder, and this is the shade 220 Natural Beige. So. This is my baby. This stick foundation. This is my baby. I've been getting this since how long has it been since I've been getting this for? For a while now. And it retails for like six bucks, seven dollars. It depends where you buy it. But this is like my go to my everything. Okay, this is my everything. This is the Wet and Wild Stick Foundation Photo Focus in classic beige I think I watched a video on it I really wanted to get into stick foundation and I like watched a video on YouTube on it and I was like oh that looks good let me go buy it cause it's cheap like it's drugstore makeup and I was like okay so let me go buy it cause it looks good and it's like not heavy it's not supposed to be heavy on your face nasty and gooey you know what I mean so I was like oh my god like I should go try this so I went to try it, I, went, I bought it in Ulta, and I went home, and I tried it, and I just loved it. I, I was obsessed. It matched my skin perfectly, and I found out about this in 7th grade summer. She basically molested me. Excuse me? She's talking about Reuben. Who are you? You boys better have money. I am not doing this for free. Wait, what? What's happening? Oh, I hear you, Joyce. His time's important, your time isn't, right? So that was all that I got from CVS, and let's move from to Ulta. Oh my gosh. Am I getting notifications? I didn't buy a lot of makeup because I have a whole box under my desk with makeup. Like, y'all can't see it, but it's there. It's full with lashes, everything. I, I have a bunch of makeup, okay? But I think I spent like, I think I spent 25 at Ulta, and at CVS I spent 30 something. Okay, cool. So first I got, um, I got a brown liner, like eye pencil, and this is the brand Essence, and bro, people sleep on Essence. Essence is good. Essence is really good. Long lasting pencil, 16 hours or whatever, and it's waterproof, and it's in the shade 02 Espresso. I got individual lashes. I was going to get two packs, but I don't think I'm going to wear them that much because I literally <laughs> have a bunch of lashes. This is not even the only pack. I have a whole box under here. Of just, I have a bunch of lashes, so I don't think I'd be wearing individual ones that much. So, you know what? I've been wearing lashes for like a while, and I still like, it still itches my eye. Like, I'm still not used to it. And I got an e.l.f. brow gel. Nothing special. Elf brow gel, clear brow gel, the instant lift brow pencil. It's an elf brow pencil. Nothing serious. It has the brush and it has the pencil. Like I bought this. I used to use dip brow for my eyebrows, but this is the easiest way to do your eyebrows, to be honest. And I don't really do a lot to my eyebrows because I have eyebrows just naturally hair, hairy like that like <laughs> so 
I've tried a bunch of mascaras, right? I've tried a bunch, but I wanted to try these from Essence because I've only tried like two mascaras from Essence and I wanted to try two more. And I tried the Lash Princess before and it was the purple one, but this one's waterproof. And yeah, this one's waterproof. It's really chunky, to be honest. Like I tried it and it's kind of chunky. Which I don't mind because that's kind of how like waterproof mascara is. Unless you get a telescopic waterproof one. I'm going to be buying more mascaras this year because I really want to get more into it. Like I've tried so many mascaras. But yeah. I always like range in different mascaras. I never stay with one because how boring is that? So anyways, this is the Lash Princess False Lash Effect Mascara and it's waterproof. And I really like this one. I think this one is one of my top 10. This one is What the Fake by Essence Volumizing Fibers and it's volum volumizing and lengthening mascara. And look at it, it's so weird looking. You know what this looks like? I'm not gonna say it. Is it basically it for makeup? blender because I need a new one I don't know where my other one went and then I bought chapstick cotton pads for my face so I went to Levi's and they had um they had a buy one get one 50% off for shirts which is not that good if you think about it because Levi's is expensive as hell it's like walking in the Gucci store but anyways not the point how much is my actually? I don't have the receipts, my mom does. Anyways, you guys. First one. It was the first one. And I got it in a size medium because I don't really like small shirts. Well, I don't like small t shirts. It's just not my thing. Like, I usually get my t shirts medium or large. Like, there's no in between. That's how I get my t shirts. But my crop tops and stuff like that are always small because, you know, tight, fit the body, you know that. But. When it comes to t-shirts, I always get medium or large because the comfort fit is the best. Bitch, you gonna step on my fucking toe, bitch, with them fucking cowgirl fucking boots, bitch, disgusting. Anyways, th that one's my favorite and I got that one in medium too. So when it comes to clothes, um, I'm very picky. I'm very picky on clothes and I'm also very picky on prices. If I don't need it, I'm not going to get it. If I have too much of the color, I'm not going to get it. Um, if it's like way too much money, I'm not going to get it. So I'm always shopping on a budget. My mom is the total opposite. If my mom likes something, she'll buy it. Okay? Total opposite. But for me, I'm always shopping on a budget. Unlike my mom. That girl will buy anything she likes but I'm not like that so I like to that's why I visit a lot of stores I don't just shop at one store I shop at many stores because you gotta look for deals and you gotta look for you know good quality clothes but like at a good price because you don't want to be spending so much on clothes I mean if you got the money you could spend that much you want on clothes like as much as you want but I would never spend like 50 bucks on a shirt like hell no unless it's some type of like merch from like an artist that I like but I would never spend that much on a shirt cuz that's that's like mind-blowing to me how much people will spend on clothes like it's just crazy like how much they would see a shirt for like what 60 bucks and they'll buy it like they got money like that but I don't got money like that so that's not an option for me so And then I also got one more thing from Levi's. And, bro, this is so cute. So, let me tell y'all the story of this. Um, I was looking at the clearance section, right? And um, I was looking at the clearance section because I didn't get to. And I always look at the clearance section because sometimes you'll be finding stuff. I mean, I don't find much, so... 
like mostly they have like large stuff extra large stuff and like clearance and stuff like y'all know the deal um but i found this crew neck 29.98 that's not bad to be honest for levi's that's not bad but um i got it for four bucks four dollars look at it oh it's so cute bye it looks like a carpet is there a line in the middle oh that's the tag hold on i don't know why it's showing like oh my god wait it is kind of dirty never mind it is dirty but um it's it's so cute i like it a lot um i think my favorite shirt out of all of these and it is kiss it's kiss look how cool i love kiss so much i was never loving you baby you were me well, wow. I want to go to Route 21 and I want to go to Spencer's. You know, Spencer's is kind of expensive. But I want to go there and I want to go to uh, Papaya. I want to go to a few stores. Calling out half of y'all. Don't get me wrong, I buy from Sheen too. But I try not to buy everything on Sheen because um, it's bad for businesses. Like, it's bad for other businesses that ship their clothes and actually make their clothes and design them, you know? It's bad. It's bad for that. But, yeah, I do shop occasionally on Sheen. Um, but I try, I, I'm trying not to. I'm trying not to. Anyways. Like, who doesn't go to Ross when you go back to school shopping? What are you doing? I'm sorry, but if you bought all your stuff online for back to school shopping, damn. Experience. The shopping experience is fun. I feel bad for everyone that be ordering everything online. Low key. Oh my god, Ross hit the jackpot. Bro, I hit the jackpot going to Ross. They had so much. And everyone was shopping there. They had so much stuff. I was so happy. Okay, the high rise gray shorts. They're not anything special. And oh my gosh. So I found this hoodie in the sports section, of course. I found this hoodie. And it's Adidas, and I don't really wear Adidas, but I do have Adidas pants. But anyways, I don't really wear Adidas, but it has a team on it. Like, I really like clothes, sportswear with, like, teams on it, because I think it looks cool. I actually like it. Um, but anyways. It's so cute. It's a hoodie. It's a hoodie. But, yes. And it retails for, I think this retails for six, sixty. Let me see. It retails for 80 80 bucks. It retails for 80 bucks and I got it for 20 That is so good. This, I got, I just got this small, like, kind of, like, tank top type of thing. Because it was, like, giving me very vintage vibes. Very, like, very 90s. You know, all that stuff. All that. And it's, like, a v-neck. And it's really cute. It was 10 bucks. That's kind of expensive. But it's cute whatever and then next i got a nike jacket i've been looking for a jacket like this everywhere okay everywhere um i've been wanting a zip a zip up dry fit um jacket for a while for a while y'all hear that i'm so sorry so i've been wanting a nike dry fit um a Nike dry fit jacket for a while but I looked on their website and I couldn't find any I was like I snatched it I was like in love but I got a gray one and then my mom picked this out because I don't know she wants me to look like a boy I guess but she picked out these have a stain on it I think name brand stuff Okay, so we're gonna start with jeans already. Okay, so these pair of jeans. Oh my gosh Go to Ross for jeans They're gorgeous. Okay, they have really good jeans right now. They have really good jeans right now like Ross is like okay Ross is kind of like they be late on the trendy stuff low-key But when they got the trendy stuff you gotta go you gotta go there. Okay 
they hit the, the bro they hit the jackpot with jeans bro if i needed more jeans i would have bought more but i have so many pants i have a lot of pants because pants bring the outfit together okay pants bring the outfit together not the shirt not the not the shoes the pants the pants and accessories bring your outfit together okay just know that so you can have a basic shirt but if you got some really nice pants some really cool pants cool looking pants or like you know out of that zone like just nice pants and then you got like some basic shoes and you got accessories on you're good to go you're good to go okay but yeah I don't like bro I have a lot of shoes to be honest I have a lot of Vans I have a few Nike shoes I have a couple of shoes but they trust me they don't they don't bring the outfit together trust me they don't it's the it's the pants and the accessories that you wear that bring the outfit together so just letting you guys know really focus on pants and really focus on your accessories um yeah anyways <laughs> they had boyfriend jeans there and oh my gosh so it says 90s boyfriend jeans and they were um how much they were $17.99 but remember there's no tax so I paid 17 bucks but like I said the more trendy stuff that Ross gets the more like like the more expensive it gets to buy there so they're having more trendy stuff that's why it's more it's getting more expensive and everyone wants trendy things so these were 17 bucks and they're gorgeous Look at them. They're light wash jeans and they're so pretty. Okay, so and then the back. they're high rise. Um, they're not super high rise, but they're pretty high rise. And they like they're meant to fit the top of your like body. So like like really tighten around your butt area and then like the leg goes like the leg is big, the leg part. And I love jeans like that so um so yeah I've been blessed I think I want to get one more pair of jeans to be honest I have but I think I want to get one more pair so did I get anything else from here no okay next are the rest of the jeans But I'm only gonna get I'm gonna get like cheaper shoes this year like I'm not gonna buy no Nikes because um my birthday's next month I'm turning 16 next month so I'm gonna get shoes then and there's specific shoes that I want I want a pair of Jordans and I want these Nikes for my birthday so I'm not gonna get expensive shoes right now because literally next month I I'm getting shoes so there's no point and I also have a lot of shoes in general so um yeah yeah that's basically it and then part in part two like in the second haul I'm gonna buy like my shoes and like probably like two more shirts I think yeah bye guys